It's our own work back to Dark Souls 2. So last time we made our way through Nutsack Demon Villain into the Shaded Woods, which frankly scared the crap out of me. In the process, we met a severed head who told us to watch out for his body, and now we're here, and there are pots that laugh at us and curse us as we go near them, and there are giant lion predator thingies. So yeah, that's a thing. Oh, and there's a giant basilisk body, and I really want to kill that damn thing, but I don't think it's a good idea right now. Now, I figure there's got to be a boss or an exit around here somewhere. Haven't actually found either of them, so we're going to randomly explore until we find something, because surely there has to be one. It might be a dead end, but I really doubt it, so... Yeah, this video may be a little bit choppy. It depends how long it takes me. I've got a tiny chunk of the petrified dragon bone. No idea what the hell that is, but it sounds badass, quite frankly. I really want to kill that damn basilisk. God damn it. Right, where are the lion people? There you are. How the hell haven't you heard or seen me? Oh, God. Okay, there's one behind me. There's two behind me. I guess I kind of should have saw that coming. Right, we're going to, uh... Hey, can you come in here? Yes, you can. So we're going to go over here. Now, I'm guessing they can't make their way across here. Now, if I had a range attack or something, we could cheese them, but I don't... Well, I probably have a crossbow, but... Where's the fun in that? Come on, buddy. Hey, ouch! Damn, you do a lot of freaking damage. Okay, th this is not good. This is very bad. Time to retreat. Are they gonna follow me down? No, apparently not. That's actually kind of handy. Whoa, okay. You're a bit, you're a bit overzealous, aren't you? Ah, we got the back step. Okay. Finally, holy shit, right. No, I kind of want to kill you, but not right now. I gotta take care of this guy. Come on, buddy. Right, just, just, can I backstab you? No, I can't, apparently not. Whatever, he's dead. Right, so there's one more lion fella over there, and there's an item apparently I didn't grab yet. I guess I fell down the pit last time, I guess that makes sense. Damn it! I really want to try and parry these dudes, but, uh, it's clearly not a good idea, because when you screw it up, and apparently I screw it up every goddamn time, you take a lot of damage. Like, a lot of damage, and great, we got two of them on us again. Well, shit, time to run away and hope they fall down the pit, but I very much doubt it's gonna happen. Hey, we got a life gem! Nope, <laughs> I'm getting freaking pits of- oh, shit! You bastards! Oh great, and now my equipment's breaking. Well, that could have gone better. I got Velociraptor Jurassic Park style. Clever girl. Okay, I kind of really want to go back to the bonfire, but it's got to respawn them all. Eh, fine, we'll do it, but uh, yeah, I may have to cut it out because I'm probably going to have to go back and kill them again. See ya, jerk ass. Okay, I figure it's just easier to run past them. I mean, they are very slow. Obviously, if we stop, we're just going to die horribly, but the plan... Mostly is just not to stop, but uh, yeah, I want to figure out where the hell the boss is or the exit or something, because there has to be one or the other around here, surely. We are far too deep into this for this to just be a dead end. Or at least if it is a dead end, there has to be something significant here. And we haven't really found either right now, so yeah, I don't know why I'm missing that. I cannot believe you just backed up from me, you di- oh! Okay, that ain't good. Well, at least we found out how to get to our wheelchair, buddy. Are they going to follow me? Doesn't look like it. Okay, we're going to open this chest, and I swear to God, if you drop down on me, I'm going to be very angry. And we get homing soul mess. Nice. Okay, right, well, who the hell are you? Ah, look how far this undead has wandered. And a very fit undead you are. Are you coming on to me? A bit too alive, but with a darkish shadow. Yet still unprepared. For a deeper dark. And like every undead, you have no future. Well, that's just mean. Oh my, don't mind me. I'm just talking amongst myself. But if you find the need for a truer dark, then meet again. We shall. You sound like a cross between Yoda and Ansem. The dark is still nascent within you. May the dark shine your way. That don't make no damn sense. The dark. Okay, apparently that's all he has to say. Good lord, that fella likes the darkness. The last time I heard someone talk about darkness that much, it was the final boss of Kingdom Hearts 1. Open yourself to darkness. Pre prepare yourself for... I can't remember the damn quotes, but he used to talk about darkness all of the damn time. He reminds me of Ansem a little bit. Anyway, I'm gonna rest of the damn bonfire because you know we didn't really kill anything. I guess I'll cut you back in when I find something new or I figure out where the bulls were going because right now, kind of running out of ideas. Did, did, please tell me I went up this tower. I don't think I did. I remember seeing it but I was being chased by like a million dudes at the time, so damn it, that's my excuse. Yeah, I don't recognize this. It's very curly. 
And there are uh, giant barrels, apparently. Is there anything up here? No. Well, okay, that was kind of pointless. Oh, there is an item there. Well, fair enough, then. What do we get? Sold of a brave warrior and a skeptic splash. That's nice and everything, but uh, still doesn't help me with where to go. I feel like maybe it's really obvious and I keep missing it, or maybe we have to go back to the Shaded Woods. Because, uh, yeah, there's bound to be more exits around there, or if nothing else, maybe some booty or something. I honestly don't know. Maybe there's going to be like a fragrant branch of yore in there, and then we can use that to uh, de-stonify one of the statues, and that's going to help us with where we have to go. I'm honestly kind of running out of ideas at this point, but uh, I think it's time we took on Basilisk Buddy, because, you know, why the hell not? We killed everything else around here, but uh, this is going to suck. Like, it's really going to suck. Now, I'm, f I'm assuming we can just cheese him from a distance, which... Yeah, probably the most effective way to do it, but where's the fun in that? So, uh, we're just gonna try and fight the guy, but we gotta be careful he doesn't do that tail swipe or whatever the hell he did to me last time, cuz that wiped me the F out. Why am I still getting cursed? What the hell? Oh shit! Holy crap! Okay, you do a lot of freaking damage. One little poke with your claw and I'm half dead. My god, okay, time to cheese the guy. We have uh, some throwing knives and some fire bombs. We could use some arrows. I don't think we can actually equip the bow, but we do have some poison arrows, I think, or fire. Maybe the poison will set him on fire, even though we can't use the bow effectively. I really don't know, but it's time to cheese the hell out of this guy, because, uh, frankly, sir, you're pissing me off. You and your giant fake eyeballs that, frankly, look kind of like titties. Okay, we poison him. Cool. Right, so uh, we're just gonna keep hammering away here, and hopefully the poison will kick the crap out of him, because it kicks the crap out of me, so I figure it's gonna be pretty damn good on the enemies. He's almost half dead already, and considering how much freaking HP he has, that ain't bad, but we're out of, uh, we're out of throwing knives. Those things are really good, I should probably buy some more. Can I get close enough to do this? Oh shit! Okay, well we got him. Don't stand in the cloud of smoke. You don't want to get petrified. At any time. My god, it takes way too long to clear. Okay, can I hit him from here? Yes, I can. Fantastic. Okay, are you low enough that I can run in and kill you now? I hope so, because these aren't going to finish you off. Now, well, Scrut's going for the kill. I beat him into attacking, and now... Die, you son of a bitch. Gotcha. Okay, I assume that guy ain't going to respawn me another petrified dragon bone. Fantastic. And apparently my sword is busted as hell. I mean, you know it degrades quickly, but holy shit does it degrade quickly. It's kind of ridiculous. We may have to change the weapon, but uh, for now it's kind of the best damn thing we have, so... Ain't really gonna want that much of a choice. Anyway, back to the bonfire, and again, I'll cut you in when I figure out something to do, or maybe we'll go back to the Shady Woods, not entirely sure yet. Oh, we went down here. Did... I don't remember doing this, but I guess I did. Fair enough, then. Okay, I repair my broken shit Lenny now. Whilst we're here, let's use our souls to get some endurance levels now. I know we don't get much stamina or endurance or whatever the hell you want to call it for these levels. No, we get kind of crap all, but uh, all I know is I don't have enough, enough stamina. I want more, goddammit. So, this may be a bad idea, it may be a really good idea, I don't know, but for now, it's what we're going with. Anyway, I'm going to go back and run around again, see if I can find any more stuff or somewhere to go or a boss or something. And if I can't find something, then eventually... We'll just go back to the Shady Woods and see what we can find there. I suspect though, probably death. Okay, well it turns out I'm the most unobservant man in the history of mankind, as I'm sure comes as no surprise to anyone, because there's a uh, section right behind the giant basilisk buddy that I didn't actually check, and there's an item up here apparently. A ferrous lockstone and a soul of a brave warrior. Again, there's some cool booty, but uh, it still doesn't help with where the hell we have to go. And this is what's kind of worrying me. If I'm missing obvious stuff like that, I'm probably missing something very obvious with where to go, so... Yeah, we gotta keep running around and see what we can find, but right now, I really have no freaking idea. Oh, there's more booty over here. Good lord, I suck. What do we get? A flame butterfly and a torch. Not really all that good, but you know, it's something, I guess. This wall looks suspicious to me. No? Well, fair enough, then. Right, so where the hell do we go now? I honestly don't know. I swear to god, I've been everywhere. I don't think I have, because... There's gotta be a boss or an exit. But I can't find it! I don't know where to go right now! God, I suck! Okay, so I see another pathway out there, and I seem to recall if we went to the top, there was some way we could sort of jump down to a bridge or something like that. In fact, I think actually we can just jump out of this window, can't we? Not that one! Yeah, this one. Now, uh, please don't die. Okay, that was, that was kind of close. 
That's what I'm saying, there's another one of these stone fellas blocking a pathway. This is what makes me think we need some more fragrant branches of your to proceed. Maybe we don't, maybe those are optional paths, but uh, I don't know, and there's a basilisk there. It's a tiny one, so I'm okay with that, but uh, I'm suspecting it's probably going to be more than just that guy. Is he dead? Yes, he is. Okay, fantastic. What do we get? Soul of a Brave Warrior in the Twilight Hub. Is it just me or there's Souls of a Brave Warrior everywhere here? Like, holy shit. But again, it seems like there's nothing actually here besides some booty, which, don't get me wrong, I like booty, but... I still don't know where the hell to go and we can't get past Lion Buddy. Where do I go, goddammit? Where do I go? I don't freaking know. Hey, this. Uh, okay. We're going in here. Mm, this might lead to something. If nothing else, we get some booty again. It's, it's kind of just the theme here. We're just getting loot. We got. Hey, we got a Black Knight Holbert, apparently. Or a Glaive, as it actually is. Still, they don't correct that shit. Maybe it actually looks like a Holbert in this game, but I kind of doubt it. Where the hell is the damn thing? That's a good question. There you are. And yes, it's a Glaive. And holy crap. That requires a lot of stats. It's like a dex weapon now. That's strange. That looks the same as I remember. Oh, I used to love that weapon. Okay, well, that's cool and everything, but uh, still... Don't know where they go. I'm gonna go back to the Shaded Woods unless that... No, that leads to where we were before. And it very well may kill me, but see, yeah, I'm gonna go back to the Shaded Woods, see what I can find there, and I'll cut you back in. Okay, well here we are in the unhappiest place on earth, let's search around here properly, you know, this time without a summon killing all of the invisible buddies that are probably gonna murder me and, uh, see how the hell this goes, but I'm suspecting we're just gonna die to invisible shit that we can't see, which I guess is kind of a redundant way to phrase that, but, uh, we're gonna die to something, then I suspect I'm probably not gonna be able to find my souls, or I'm probably gonna die before I get back to it, but hey, hey, we found a chest, holy shit, something just shot at me, maybe I'm being pessimistic, but, uh, I really don't think so. Right, let's go loot this chest and hopefully not die along the way, but, uh, yeah, when I can't see what the hell I'm fighting and I don't really even know what to expect here, this ain't gonna go well. Like, it's really, really nuts. And then guarding this? Probably. And there's, uh, there's a blood stain. Well, that don't bode well, does it? Are you a trap? No. Okay. What the hell? Oh, God! Okay, something's hitting me. I can kind of see a shadow there. It looks like a regular dude, but he's all shadowy and you can't lock on, apparently. Good lord, you do a lot of damage, holy shit. Okay, well I killed him. That's something. Now if he's the only enemy here, we're in the clear, but that ain't gonna happen. There's gonna be a million of them, you can just tell. Anyway, let's go get the damn loot. God, what a dick. Interrupting me whilst I'm looting shit. Right, what do we get? We get a Colorant 3 ring, plus one apparently. That's interesting. I assume that's just an upgraded version of it. I didn't know that was a thing, but I guess it is. It weighs more. And it has less durability, so yeah, I assume this is a better Chloranthi ring. Right, so uh, yeah, I can't wonder... Uh, yeah, let's get rid of the uh, Ash Knuckle ring or whatever the hell we're using, because... Don't think it's essential right now. Hopefully it's not, but... Uh, yeah, Traphead, yeah, no shit, buddy. No shit. Anyway, so we gotta go... Oh god, something's beat me up. Duh! I, I don't know why I'm fight. What the hell? Oh, it's a ghost of a player. That's all I need right now. There you are. What's up, buddy? Duh, you son of a bitch. Yeah. Get out of here, you invisible bastard. You see, that's the mistake that the Ghostbusters made. That's why they're out of business now. Instead of using proton packs and shit, should have just used a giant sword of justice. Right, so I, there's even more blood here, which is more concerning to me, and I, I frankly kind of lost right now. Looks like there's a pit of doom over to the left, so it's not going go that way. And we seem to have found another chest and another invisible bastard. My god! Stand still! There you I I kind of see you. I... I... I can't hit this guy, he keeps moving. Oh my god. We need freaking Benny Hill music here, what the hell? Finally! My god! <laughs> and we get the old sun ring. Don't know what the hell that is, but god damn was that a lot of work to get. Explodes it? What? I... Okay, so apparently it explodes when we take damage, I think, but it doesn't hurt us or destroy the ring, but uh, I, I don't know. Tan's cool as hell, though, so we're gonna go with that and see what the hell it does, but uh, yeah. 
I'm kind of expecting that we're just going to combust and die, even though it says that that doesn't happen. I don't trust it. This is Dark Souls. I don't trust anything in this game. I just don't trust this freaking Forest of Doom. Where the hell is everything? Like, I, there must be another exit around here or something. I, I don't know where to go right now. I am so miserably lost. What the hell? Right, so uh, we're going to use a light gem, because I'm pretty damn sure there's an enemy around here somewhere. I swear I saw it. It could have been Ghost of Another Player. could have been my mind playing tricks on me. Nope, there's something right there. Duh! Ouch. Don't... Okay. The ring blew. <laughs> that was awesome. I think that actually hit him. And nothing else that looked cool as hell. Okay, now, wait a minute. Let me check. Uh, wait. Yeah, the ring's actually taking a whole bunch of damage, so I assume, you know, we're looking at maybe 10 explosions, something like that, and then it's gonna break, which... I guess it ain't that great, but, uh, well, maybe more than 10. You can probably use the, uh... I can't remember what the hell it was called, but there's, like, a ring that slows equipment degradation. I can't freaking speak today. It slows equipment degradation, so I'm assuming that works on rings as well, so... Yeah, maybe with that, you can just blow up on everything, like a suicide bomber. Ah! Uh, and I backstabbed him. Suck on that, I backstab the invisible freaking man. That's how damn badass I am. I've got a large soul of a something soldier. Nameless? I don't freaking know, I wasn't paying attention. Still don't know where the hell to go, though. I'm assuming there's more loot around here, because this place apparently is freaking gigantic, but, uh... Yeah, I feel like so far we got kind of lucky. I feel like there's probably going to be a huge ambush of invisible men around here somewhere. Probably by the most important item, or maybe a pathway or something, but, uh... Yeah, right now we haven't found jack shit. Can I attempt to read that message, but at the same time I don't want spoilers. And I meant to mention thank you everyone for not giving me, you know, major spoilers in the chat. I do appreciate it. Plus, uh, you know, I know how frustrating it is to see someone missing obvious shit that you know is there. And, you know, doing things wrong. So, thank you everyone for the patience, because, uh, even now I know there's a whole bunch of shit that I miss. So, yeah. Back again? Well, this is a pleasant surprise. I like you too, head buddy. I like you too. Right, so I just want to see very quickly whilst we're here, since we found him again accidentally, what exactly he's selling, because I didn't pay that much attention last time. I do kind of want some more gold pine res, and nothing else is particularly handy right now, so frankly, get out of my sights, you headless one, I guess, bodiless bastard. Anyway, so uh, yeah, I'm going to explore some more around here. If I find something, I'll cut you in, but I feel like we found at least the bulk of the stuff around here, but uh... Yeah, I'll cut you in when I figure out where we're finally going, or when we find something, because I'm missing something, clearly. Fuck me sideways, did I seriously miss a pathway here? Apparently so. What the hell? How did I miss this? I'm the most unobservant man ever. I'm so sorry. I, I am so, so sorry to everyone that knew this was here and had to watch me run past this a million times. Oh my god, I'm so ashamed of myself right now. How did I miss that? It's so damned obvious. What the hell, man? What the hell? Okay, well anyway, it looks like we found our boss, so uh, let's get prepared here. Don't know what the hell we're expecting, so I don't really know how we can prepare, but... Screw it, we can at least get some healing gear on the bar. Okay? What the hell? Oh, there's a chick in the ground. Hello? Oh shit! Okay, check the ground, shooting magic at me. I'm assuming this is, uh... Yeah, you you are definitely gonna come out of the ground and be like twice the damn... In fact, probably more than that. Yeah. <laughs> Grand's a giant freaking scorpion. scorpion this? No, just... I don't... I don't know how to say your name, and holy crap, you do a lot of freaking damage. And, uh... You just broke something. You're ruining your damn lair. Okay, so I'm guessing you're like Quaylock 2.0. And, uh... Oh god, okay, so I'm guessing that's gonna poison us or maybe even toxic, so we don't wanna get hit by that shit. It's it's going well so far, I have to say. She takes a lot of damage, so uh Yeah, I, I we're doing okay here. Gotta be careful though, because she did shoot magic at us, so I'm go Oh god! I thought she was gonna grab me, what the hell? She did shoot magic at us, so I'm guessing she can actually Did I cut a tail off? Apparently I did. Interesting. But yeah, I'm guessing she's gonna have some kind of a magic attack or something, so gotta be careful of that, because as we know, magic, real goddamn OP. Okay, I wonder if we can have like an advantage here standing slightly down. Oh shit, that ain't good. Apparently there's an item on this tree here, so I'm gonna stand here. This may be a really bad idea, but uh, I'm guessing she has to bust out the ground and break it. Where the hell is she going? I, come here, come on. What the hell are you doing? Oh god, what? Shit, no! 
Oh god, that <laughs> scared the crap out of me. And the ring exploded on her. Well, in a nice try, ring. Nice try. Okay, so, uh, note to self, when she dives on the ground, she's pretty damn dangerous. But, uh, yeah, for a first attempt, I'd say that went okay, so, uh, I'll see you back at the bus. Okay, let's dance, baby. Round two, and we kinda know what to expect now, but like I say, I'm expecting some kind of insane magic... Jesus Christ! Some kind of insane magic attacks. Now, I don't know if when we hit her on the ground... You bitch! Okay, well, we just lost a whole bunch of HP, and, uh, yeah, I was gonna say, I don't know if the damage we do to her while she's on the ground actually affects her HP bar. The answer is no. No, it doesn't. Also, I really want this item on here. Now, this may be a piece of crap, this may be a whole waste of time, this may get me killed immediately. Oh, Jesus Christ! Yeah, she's got magical rights. Probably because we're at a distance. Yeah, I, I really want the thing on the log, but that, that's, that's not gonna be a good idea, is it? Oh, God. Shoot magic at the log. I want free booty, goddammit. Well, you know, you can run over. Just just knock the damn... Oh, jeez! Just knock the damn thing over. That's all I want from you. You are not working with me here, Scorpion Wench. You're being very, very inconsiderate. Don't attack me! God damn it! She does a lot of damage. I mean, she takes it good as well, which... That's what she said, or I guess he said. Oh, God! Okay, that's, uh... We're gonna die. Oh, it's uh, toxic. Fantastic. <laughs> okay, we have the drink. Da -da -da -da. Damn it! Well, shit, that... <laughs> That could have gone worse. <laughs> a little bit ashamed of myself right now, because we're not in the Champion's Covenant anymore, so I can't use that as an excuse. Don't get me wrong, there's a pretty damn decent one. Oh, God. <laughs> I really suck, but, uh, yeah, we're not in that Covenant anymore, so I can't use that as an excuse for my, you know, inept failure. But, uh... Yeah, I feel like this is one of those bosses where you shouldn't really be dying. She doesn't seem that bad, honestly. She takes damage pretty damn quickly. She, you know, uh, besides that shit, you know, she leaves herself open for attack for a long time like that, and as long as we don't go from a distance, she doesn't really seem to do the magic, and she seems reasonably predictable, but, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm just kind of screwing up right now. Oh, great. Fan. Fantastic. She's got like freaking homing soul mass, and I don't know when to dodge. Holy shit! Really, there's more? I could have easily died there again. God, that would have sucked. Okay, now just just let me beat the crap. Really? You hit me go- What the hell? That's some bullshit! I can't believe she hit me going in twice. I even tried to move away. Oh, that was a crappy death. I mean, still my fault, but damn. That sucked. Okay, let's give this a try again. Now, if nothing else, at least I'm learning. You know, don't attack her when she's on the ground because it doesn't do any goddamn damage and then you get the hell out of the way and just beat the crap out of her when she jumps out. And don't stand there and let that shit happen. I gotta say, it surprises me actually that her talents don't actually cause toxic or poison unless she grabs you because uh, she's booked me with that shit a couple of times and it hasn't actually done it, which that seems a little generous for FromSoft, I have to say. And good lord, you and your magic, you are very... Very friggin' annoying, right? I need to heal, but we're gonna be careful here. Okay, just, just, da, da 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 Okay, perfect time to heal, if I wasn't staggered. Oh god, you suck. That's right, do the tail thing. Perfect, right? Chug on that freaking Estus, like you've never chugged before. Okay, we're back up at full HP, we've done some damage to her. This time is the time I can feel it. Oh, you know, you can just hit me again. Oh shit! Damn it, man. You are, Oh, God, I hate you. I can't even blame her for that shit. I just should get out of the way. It's very simple. Really? <laughs> that hit me? God damn it, man. What the hell is going on today? Okay, this time we're gonna code our weapon in the end some special darkness. And, uh, you know, she's probably not weak to it, but you never know, she might be. If nothing else, I figure I should do some more damage, because I don't see why the hell it wouldn't, even if she's resistant to it. Theoretically, it should do something extra so. And we need all the damn help we can get, because she, she, she is not easy as I thought she was going to be, at least not for me personally, but, uh, yeah, typically she clips me again. God, you suck, right? Detail her, because those are the things that are getting me killed all of the goddamn time. Well, not all of the time, but most of the time. Hey. Oh, shit. Da -da -da -da. <laughs> I suck. Okay, no more messing around here. It's time to get serious, because uh, we are down way too much to this bitch. Okay, get out of the ground. I don't get hits. Perfect. 
Okay, now just beat the crap out of her. Now don't rush. Beat the crap out of her, but don't rush, because uh, that's half the problem here, is I'm rushing. It's kind of just the way I play. You know, I'm bullish to the wall, we live hard and die fast and often, so... Uh, yeah, we really have to take our time. It's not in my style to do that, but that's kind of necessary, because she's real quick and really deadly. Uh -huh. Now cut those damn tails off, for Christ's sakes. Well, we didn't cut them off, but we at least did some damage, god damn you. Be careful. Okay, perfect. Well, not perfect, really, because you drained a whole bunch of my stamina, and I kind of need that now. Okay, come here. Come on, do the tail attack. No. Yeah, that's a bad scorpioness. Do the tail attack. Yep. You're not complying here. You are never complying. Oh, sh oh my god, I hate you so much. Okay, well, uh, we need to know. Oh god, don't run towards her. We need to not get hit when she does that. Wait a second. There's a stone thing over there. I wonder if you can stand on that and not get hit by it. I'm not going to have the time. Damn it. Well, that sucks. But, uh, yeah, I kind of want to test that. I don't know if we're going to get the opportunity. Okay, well, I'm dead. I guess maybe we will get the opportunity, but I noticed there was a stone thing there, and I'm thinking... Maybe if you stand on that, she can't actually pop out underneath you and hit you. Maybe she can, but uh, we'll give that a try next time. Okay, well, this is my last dose of the Ants and Pam resin, so this time we actually have to beat her, otherwise it's going to be even tougher. And I know, I know for a damn fact when I upload this video, everyone's going to say, Oh, I beat her on my first try, you suck. Trust me, I know I suck. This ain't news to me. I'm not proud of myself. What can I say? But, uh, yeah, I mean, Dark Souls is one of those things, I've said it a million times, I died, like, 15 times on the way to the Taurus Demon, going for freaking Filing Shrine, just to get to him. I am real bad at Dark Souls, the only reason I get any decent at Dark Souls is because I learn where enemies are and, you know, how to fight them, you know, knowledge, knowing is half the battle, in fact, more than that, so, uh, yeah, you know, I'm going into this blind, I'm trying to commentate at the same time, so, it makes it even harder than it would be anyway, but, uh, yeah, I'm just not good at it, so, yeah, I fully expect everyone's gonna tell me how much I suck when I upload this, but damn it, what do you want me to do? I'm terrible. Okay, perfect, we blocked that damn attack, and she just stop jumping back and casting magic! God, I hate you, at least I got a chance to heal, but god damn. The hell are you do- no, 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 no! There's some cheap shit! Like, holy hell, sorcery is so damn overpowered in Dark Souls, I mean, don't get me wrong, she's a boss, it's okay, but in PvP, that shit's insane. Right, we're gonna chuck the sisters. I know we're only missing a ton of bit of HP, and I don't give a shit. Right, we're gonna make our way over the stone thing, but uh, she's kind of blocking the pathway. Perfect. Now, uh, don't attack me. Right now, I'm assuming. Uh, yeah, it looks like she can't actually. Well, maybe I don't know. I wasn't exactly on the thing, but uh, yeah, it looks to me like she can't burrow out underneath that. But there is a blood stain on top of it. But that could be entirely coincidental. So, yeah, I can't want to test that. But at the same time, I really need to heal. Get away from me. Okay. Perfect. See, just keep doing that shit and you ain't no damn problem. It's when you start burrowing on the ground and you're doing your damn magic bullshit and grabbing me and toxicing me. That's when you get annoying. And uh, those claw swipes are very quick and deadly as well. And she always seems to hit me with two of them. So, uh, you know, if the first one hits me, the second one's going to. So, uh, that's kind of an issue as well. You bitch. You absolute bitch. Okay, we do, we're doing okay here. She's draining my stamina like hell, but I'm waiting for my damned opportunity. Perfect. Now run in. Yes! Okay, one tail down, and we got some more damage off. Fantastic. Now get your ass over here so I can beat the crap out of it. I kind of want to heal again, like really badly. And I'm going to. If I want to actually go out of the freaking way. Oh, she's using magic again. Well, fantastic. Okay, we stayed her, but uh, that's going to hit me anyway, so we need to get the balls out of here. Okay. We're fine, we're missing a tiny bit of HP, but it ain't that bad, and again, I need to get on that damn stone thing right away. Now, here's the ultimate test. If we stand here, stand right in the middle, can she actually burrow underneath me? Come on, baby. Apparently she can't. Fan, freaking fantastic, you are mine. No, 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 we have to end this one way. Jump attack! And Scorpion S. Nechka is down. Suck on that, you scorpion wench. Alrighty, I'm gonna end it here. Thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, I would appreciate it a lot. And I'll see you next time for more Dark Souls 2.